वेलकम टू डिटेल वर्कशॉप ऑन वैदिक मैथ्स पार्ट वन वैदिक मैथ्स पार्ट वन कंसिस्ट ऑफ टोटल फिफ्टीन टॉपिक्स विच विल बी कवर्ड इन थ्री सेशन ईच सेशन विल कंसिस्ट ऑफ फाइव टॉपिक्स लेट्स गो थ्रू टॉपिक्स ऑफ सेशन वन फर्स्ट टॉपिक हिस्ट्री ऑफ वैदिक मैथमेटिक्स सेकेंड टॉपिक टेबल्स ऑफ नंबर एंडिंग विथ नाइन third topic tables of any two digit numbers fourth topic multiplication special case and fifth topic multiplication by six please subscribe to our youtube channel srs vedic mathematics academy let us start with the first topic history of vedic mathematics Vedic maths is an ancient Indian system of mathematics. It was discovered from Vedas by Swami Sri Bharti Krishna Tirtha Ji. He was eminent scholar of mathematics, Sanskrit, history, and philosophy. You can see his photograph on the screen. At the beginning of twentieth century. there was great interest in sanskrit text in europe and that attracted some european scholars to visit india to study them during their study they came across some text under the heading ganita sutras that is mathematical formulae as they could not find any meaning in the translation they dismissed that text Sri Bharti Krishna Tirtha Ji spent eight years, nineteen eleven to nineteen eighteen, in forest solitude in his attempt to interpret text under the heading Ganit Sutras that European scholars had dismissed. After lengthy and careful investigation, he was able to reconstruct the Vedic mathematics. According to his research, Vedic mathematics consists of sixteen main sutras. Sutras refers to word form, and thirteen sub sutras, which can be applied in different mathematical calculation to make them faster and easier. The first book on Vedic mathematics was published in the year nineteen sixty five. Let's go to sixteen sutras, sixteen main sutras. It's a list of sixteen main sutras. On left hand side, what you see is in Sanskrit, and right hand side is the English meaning of the same. If you consider first sutra, it is Eka Dike Na Purve Na. That is in Sanskrit. The English meaning of the same is by one more than one before. The simple meaning of this. Sutra is add one, increase by one. Second sutra, all from nine and last from ten. Third sutra, vertically crosswise. Fourth, transpose and apply, and so on. Total, there are sixteen main sutras. Let's study benefits of using Vedic mathematics. The first basic benefit is cultivates. an interest for numbers and eliminates math phobia present in the student math phobia refers to fear of math if student don't like math with just basic study of vedic math student start liking math it is 10 to 15 times faster than normal math in some cases it is more than 100 times faster it is easy to understand easy to apply easy to remember and makes maths enjoyable one point with which we prove this is in vedic mathematics any calculation can be done if you just know 1 to 9 table up to five means first half of the table from 1 to 9 so that is very very easy sharpens the mind increases mental ability and intelligence vedic math when you practice orally mentally it forces you to use both sides of the brain 
and that's how it increases your mental ability and intelligence. Finally, increases speed and accuracy, which helps students to score in competitive exams. So that's brief about history of Vedic mathematics. Let's pause here and try to answer these questions on history of Vedic mathematics. So first question, who discovered Vedic mathematics? Answer to this question is Krishna Second question How many years were spent for discovery of Vedic mathematics? The answer here is eight years, and those years were 1911 to 19. 18. Next question. How many main sutras are present in Vedic mathematics? The answer is 16. The 16 main sutras. Besides this, there are 13 sub sutras. Next, list any two sutras of Vedic mathematics out of 16 sutras which you have just listed. You want to list any two sutras. The first sutra is by one and the one before. If the simple meaning of this sutra is add one or increase by one. Second sutra all from nine. So you can list any two out of the total 16 sutras which you have listed. Next, list any two benefits of Vedic mathematics. We have listed five, any two out of that. First benefit is removes net phobia. And phobia refers to fear of maths. So there is a very important basic use of Vedic mathematics. It removes math phobia from. Second, you can put 10 to 15 times faster. Next question, which year first book on Vedic mathematics was published and that is 1965. So that completes our first topic of first session, history of Vedic mathematics. Let's go to the next topic. Second topic is tables of number ending with nine the last digit if it is nine how we can quickly generate table any number whose last digit is nine you can generate table quickly let's see how we are going to use first sutra for this let's take first example table of 19. the method goes like this you take the digit before nine that is one in this case before nine is one and our first sutra says add one. One plus one is two. Whatever answer you get here, that you have to use as an increment on the left hand side like this. One plus two, three. Three plus two, five. Five plus two, seven. Seven plus two, nine. Nine plus two, eleven. Eleven plus two, thirteen. 13 plus 2, 15. 15 plus 2, 
17. 17 plus 2, 19. Now, 19 is the same number for which you are writing table. When you get that, you have to just stop and write 0, 1, 2, 3 from bottom to top like this. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9 is already there. That completes table of 19. Next example will be 29, table of 29. Digit before 9 here is 2. You can take a pause here and try to solve it. Add 1 gives you 3. So in this case, you'll have to add, go on adding 3, like this. 2 plus 3, 5. 5 plus 3, 8. 8 plus 3, 11. 11 plus 3, 14. 14 plus 3, 17, 17 plus 3, 20, 20 plus 3, 23, 23 plus 3, 26, and 26 plus 3, 29. Same number for which you are writing table. Stop there. You have to get the same number. If you are not getting this, there is a mistake already. So when you get the same number, stop and write 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9 is already there. The second step remains the same, just writing 0, 1, 2, 3 from bottom to top. First step, you will just check the increment. For example, make 39, and just pause and try that. Digit before 9 is 3, plus 1 gives you 4. So here, increment is 4. 3 plus 4, 7. 7 plus 4, 11. 11 plus 4, 15. 15 plus 4, 19. 19 plus 4, 23. 23 plus 4, 27. 27 plus 4, 31. 31 plus 4 is 35. And 35 plus 4 is 39. Same number. So stop. And second step is 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9 is already there. Let's try one more. 49. Digit before 9 is 4. Plus 1 gives you 5. So here increment is 5. 4 plus 5, 9. 9 plus 5, 14. 14 plus 5, 19. 19 plus 5, 24. 24 plus 5, 29. 29 plus 5 is 34. 34 plus 5 is 39. 39 plus 5 is 44. And 44 plus 5 is 49. The same number for which you are writing table. Stop there and write. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9 is already there. So continue with further numbers 59, 69. Okay. The last digit should be 9 to use this method. Let's go to the next topic. Third topics, we have completed first two topics now. Third topics, tables of any two-digit numbers. So this is totally general method. And to use this method, you have to just know table of 1 to 9, single digit table from 1 to 9. And with that, you can generate table of any two-digit numbers. Let's try table of 21. So write these numbers with the digits with a gap. Because you have to write separately table of 2, table of 1, and then join and create table of 21. So first table of 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. Table of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 
9 and 10. So first step is over writing single digit table. The, then to generate table of 21, as long as there is single digit to the right, just see the right hand side, single digit, just join, no calculation, 21. Single digit, just join, 42, 63, 84, 105, 126, 147, 168, 189. So here up to this, it was single digit. Here there's a double digit. For double digit, small calculation is there. This extra digit you have to add to the left. 20 plus 1, 21. And last digit you have to join. Zero you have to join. 20 plus 1 is 20. Next we'll try 31. Take a pause and try yourself. Table of 31. You have to write first table of 3. 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30. Table of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. First step is over writing single digit table. As long as the single digit to the right, just join. 31, 62, 93, 1, 2, 4, 1, 5, 5, 1, 8, 6, 2, 1, 7, 2, 4, 8, 2, 7, 9. So up to this, it was single digit. So here double digit, that extra you have to add to the left. 30 plus 1, 31. And last digit you have to join. So both these examples, we have got units place 1. Let's try 12 now, where units place digit is 2. So first you have to write table of 1 and 2, and then join. Table of 1, 2. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Table of 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. First step is over, writing single digit table. And then as long as it's single digit to the right, just join. 12, 24, 36, 48. Now, here double digit started. First two example only, last step there was a double digit, but it can come anywhere. So, moment is a double digit, it will continue for all remaining numbers. 5 plus 1, 6, and then last year, whatever last year, that will come same here. 6 plus 1, 7, last week 2. 7 plus 1, 8, last week 4. 8 plus 1, 9, 6. 9 plus 1, 10, and last week here is 8. And 10 plus 2, 12, and last week is 2. So pause here and try table of 13. First table of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Table of 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27. 30. The first step is lower. Now, as long as the single digit to the right, just join. 13, 26, 39. And double digit start from fourth step here. 4 plus 1, 5, 52. 5 plus 1, 6, 65. 6 plus 1, 7, 78. 7 plus 2, 9, 91. 8 plus 2, 
10, 1, 0, 4. 9 plus 2, 11, 1, 1, 7. 10 plus 3, 13, 1, 2, 0. Like this, you can generate table of any two-digit number. It's a totally general method of generating table. Let's try some more examples. Say table of 23. We have read table of 2 and table of 3. Table of 2. 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. Table of 3. 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30. So first step is over single digit table. As long as the single digit 46, 69, 4 digits, so you have to add 8 plus 1, 9, 92. 10 plus 1, 11, 1, 1, 5. 12 plus 1, 13, 1, 3, 8. 14 plus 2, 16, 1, 6, 1. 10 plus 2, 18, 1, 8, 4. 18 plus 2 is 20. 18 plus 2 is 20. And last is 7, 2, 0, 7. 20. 23 plus 0. Let's try one more. You can pause and try yourself. 42. So first you have to write table of 4 and 2. Table of 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32, 36, 40. Table of 2. 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. So first step that is over single digit table. Now, as long as the single the single digit here, just join 1, 2, 6. Again, single digit, just join 1, 6, 8. Now, double digit starts here. It will continue for all the remaining number. 20 plus 1, 21. And last is 0, 2, 1, 0. 24 plus 1, 25. Last is 2. 29, 28 plus 1, 29. Last is 4. 32 plus 1, 33. Last with 6. 36 plus 1, 37. Last with 8. And 40 plus 2, 42. Last with 2. So that completes table of 42. Like this, you can generate table. table. So let's go to the next topic. The fourth topic, we have completed three topics so far. The fourth topic, multiplication special case. So this is one of the method of multiplication in Vedic mathematics. Vedic mathematics contains total seven different methods of multiplication. Out of that, form of note, digits at tens place are same and sum of digits at one one's place is 10. You can see that this rule is satisfied for this example. Digit at 10's place is same, same digit, 4, 4. It can be anything, 5, 5, 9, 9. And sum of digits at 1's place is 10. 3 plus 7 is 10. So like that, there are the combination 2 plus 8 is 10, 5 plus 5 is 10, and so on. Now first, we'll try to compare by solving the same problem, first with normal maths, and then Vedic maths. Let's go through normal maths method. First, you have to multiply by 7. 7 into 3. 7 3 is 21. So, 1 carry 2. 7 4 is 28 plus 2 is 30. This is the first line of calculation. 
with normal mass. Then we put zero here and start multiplying with the four. Four into three, four multiplied by three is 12. So two carry one. Four into four is 16 plus one, 17. So that is the second line. And then you have to add this. So this is one, zero plus two is two. 3 plus 7 is 10, so 0, carry 1 here, 1 plus 1 is 2. So answer is 2, 0, 2, 1. So this is your school method of multiplication. Let's now try fast method using weighted mass, but not very important. You have to use this method only when this condition is satisfied. That digits at 10th place is same, and this sum should be 10. So method goes like this. Take common digit at tens place and multiply with one more. Four plus one is five. So other way you can say the next number. So take common, just understand how we got a five. So next number or four plus one, our first sutra. Four plus one is five. Multiply these digits at one's place on the right hand side. Three multiplied by seven. Four multiplied by five is 20. Three multiplied by Seven is twenty-one. Join, and that's the answer which you know is the correct answer because you already solved with normalness. So this way you can solve it orally. Four. Next number is five. So left hand side four into five twenty. Three into seven that you have to multiply on the right hand side. Three into seven is twenty-one. Twenty twenty-one. Let's try some more problem. Say. 32 multiplied by 38. So first check that it satisfies the rule. 3 is common here and 2 plus 8 is 10. So it satisfies. So take common that is 3. Multiply with one more or next number. Multiply digits at one's place on the right hand side. So this is 12. This is 16. Join and answer is 1 to 1, 6, 1260. Once you understood the method, you can write diary cards. Fifty-four multiplied by fifty-six. Five is common here. Four plus six is ten. So five. Next number is six. Four into six. This is thirty. This is twenty-four. So answer is 3024, 3024. Twenty-three multiplied by twenty-seven. Two is common, three plus seven is ten. So satisfies the rule. Take common digit, multiply the one more, multiply digits at one's place on the right hand side. This is six, this is twenty-one. So answer is six to one. Ninety four multiplied by ninety six. Nine is common. Four plus six is ten. So satisfy that. Nine. Next number is ten. Multiply digits at one's place on the right hand side. This is 99. Multiplying by 10 is very simple. Just skip one zero. This is 24. Nine zero. Eighty five multiplied by eighty five. So eight is common and five plus five is ten. So it satisfies the rule. Eight is common. Five multiplied by five. 8 into 9 is 72. This is 25. 7 to 2. 5. See, the steps are given here. You can see, take common digit at 10th place. Now, in this case, it's 4. And multiply the next number. Okay. One more is nothing but next number. Multiply digits at 1's place. That is here. On the right hand side. And then, just join. 4 into 5 is 20, 3 into 7 is 21. And then so only when it satisfies this rule, you can use this method. 
let's try about problems. And before that, you just note that combinations which can come in the ones place is 1, 9, 2, 8, 3, 7, 4, 6, and 5, 5. These are the only combination. Instead of 1, 9, it can be 9, 1. Instead of 2, 8, it can be 8 and 2. And if you just multiply this, this is what you have to do on the right hand side. Let's see the different answers. Here you get answer is 9. Here you get 16. Here you get 21. Here you get 24. And it's 24. So right hand side you can get only this common. Only what very important thing what you have to notice. You see here all answers here are two digit only for this one and nine combination you get single digit there you have to put zero on the right hand side zero nine so we just writing nine it should be zero nine for example 51 multiplied by 59 then five next number is six right hand side one into nine this is 30 this 9 you write as 0, 09 and answer is 3009. Let's try one more 79 multiplied by 71. 7, next number is 8, 9 multiplied by 1. 7 into 8 is 56, 9 into 1 is 9. That we said that you write 0, 09. That is 5609. Now you can extend this rule for more digits. For example, like this 104 multiplied by 106. So now just modify the rule like this. Sum of the digits at one's place is 10, and rest all digits should be common. Then you can continue the same method. Take common digits that is 10 in this case multiply with one more 10 one more is 11 multiply digits at one's place on the right hand side and when you are multiplying here instead of doing 10 into 11 do 11 into 10 that is easier because multiplying by 10 means just take this number and put 0 this is 24 so answer is 1102 Pause and try yourself this one zero two. At any point, you just pause and try yourself, and then continue with the video. So here it is ten. Next number is eleven. Two into eight. Eleven into ten is one one zero. This is sixteen. So the answer is one one zero one six. Nine nine four. Multiplied by 996. 99 is common here and 4 plus 6 is 10. So take common that is 99. Next number one more is 100. So it becomes very easy for calculation. 4 multiplied by 6. Multiplied by 100 means just skip two zeros in front of that number. This is 24. So answer is 9900. Nine nine three multiplied by nine 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 seven. Nine 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 is common. Next number is thousand. Three into seven. So multiplying by thousand is just three zeros. Nine 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 zero zero zero. This is twenty one. So answer is nine. Nine zero 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 two one one nine two multiplied by one nine eight. So nineteen is common here, two plus eight is ten. So take common, multiply the next number, nineteen plus one is twenty. Two into eight. So 19 into 2 is 38. 
Just do this 19 into 238 and then put this zero. Zero is at the end with the main element. 16, so answer is 38016. So try yourself more problem and solve it. First, you have to generate problem. Like for example, if you consider first number as 74, the second number you should note that if you want to satisfy this rule, the second number. This has to be same, so it has to be 7. This sum here should be 10, so only with 6 here, you get sum as 10. Like this, generate problem yourself and solve it. Let's go to the next topic now. The fifth topic, the last topic of our first session. Sorry, not this. Fifth top is multiplication by series of nine. There are two cases we are going to consider. So first, we'll solve one problem with normal mass and then try the same with a Vedic mass. So here one number will be all nine. Then you can use the method what we are going to learn now. So first, normal mass, nine multiplied by five, nine five of 45. So five carry four. 9, 7s are 63, 63 plus 4 is 67. Then you put 0 here, and now you have to multiply again with the 9, it will be the same answer, 9, 5 are 45, 5 carry 4, 9, 7s are 63 plus 4 is 67. And then you have to add 5, 7 plus 5 is 12, so 2 carry 1, 6 plus 7, 13 plus 1, 14, 4 carry 1, 6 plus 1, 7, 7, 4, 2, 5. Okay, this is your normal school method of multiplication. And now we'll do Vedic maths. The steps are given here. The first step is reduce by 1. And second step is subtract all from 9 and last from 10. So the Topic is multiplication by series of nine. So one number will be all nine. Take the other number, 75 here. Reduce by one. One less will give 74. So that is the first step or first part of the answer. Second part here, it says subtract all from nine, last from 10. So subtract all. If there is big number, subtract all digits from nine, and last from 10. Nine minus seven is two. Last from 10, 10 minus five is and you got dance. It's all more problem. 68 multiplied by 99. First step, one less. 68 minus 1 is 67. The first part of the second part. Subtract all from 9, last from 10. 9 minus 6 is 3. And last from 10, 10 minus 8 is 2. 4, 8, 3 multiplied by 9, 9, 9. Now note that we are working with the case 1. The case 1 here basically number of digits and number of 9s are same. So when you have done 3 digits here, there should be 3 9s. So that is case 1. Then we will go for case 2. So the steps remain the same. Reduce by 1. When, you, when it's uh, reduced by 1, this last digit will reduce by 1. Other digits will remain same. 4, 8, and last digit 3 will become 2. Second part, subtract all from 9, last from 10. 9 minus 4 is 5. 9 minus 8 is 1. And last from 10. 9 minus 8 is 1. Multiplied by nine nine nine. Okay, so first step one less. Only last digit will reduce by one. Four eight six nine three seven eight becomes seven. And second part here is all from nine. Subtract all from nine. Last from ten. 
9 minus 4 is 5, 9 minus 8 is 1, 9 minus 6 is 3, 9 minus 9 is 0, 9 minus 3 is 6, and last from 10, 10 minus 8 is 2. That's the answer. Three, nine, six, four, eight, five, six, seven, two, nine, four, two, eight, nine. Multiplied by second number should be all nine, nine, nine. Nine. So here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So second number is all 14 nines. So answer will be double of that 14. That means 28 digit answer. First step is just take all this digit as it is. Only last you will have to reduce by 1. So it is 3, 9, 6, 4, 8, 5, 6, Seven, two, nine, four, three, eight, eight. Very important. This nine becomes eight here. Okay. And second part, just point out here and answer. Nine minus three is six. Nine minus nine is zero. Nine minus six is three. Nine minus four is five. 9 minus 8 is 1, 9 minus 5 is 4, 9 minus 6 is 3, 9 minus 7 is 2, 9 minus 2 is 7, 9 minus 9 is 0, 9 minus 4 is 5, 9 minus 3 is 6, 9 minus 8 is 1, and last from 10. 10 minus 9 is 1. Let's check how many digit answer you got. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. Double. 14 digit multiplied 14 digit. This answer you cannot get on computer or calculator because it cannot represent such a big number. Okay. But in very nice, you can solve it orally. Okay. So this is case one where number of digits and number of nines are same. Let's try for case two. Case two, what you are taking is number of digits are less than number of nine the number of nines are more but the method what you have just learned will work only when number of digits and number of nines are same and that you can easily make same just by putting zero here so now with this zero it becomes same as our earlier case one so our answer is zero two four seven one less and second part, 9 minus 0 is 9. This 0 is important here because the corresponding with 9 should come here. 9 minus 2 is 7. 9 minus 4 is 5. And last from 10. So accordingly, this 9 will come. Final answer, this 0 is not required. Whether you write this 0 or not, does not make a difference. Say 25. Multiplied by 9999. Nine, nine. Now you see here there are four nines, whereas first number is only two digits, so you have to put two zeros. So with that, it will be a normal problem 0, 0, 2, 4, first step. And second, 9 minus 0 is 9, 9 minus 0 is 9, 9 minus 2 is 7, and last from 10, 10 minus 5. So so final answer actually you can write two four nine nine seven five. These zeros at the left does not change the value.
So here then a five nine so as number is only three digits. So to match, you have to put two zeros so that it's you know, five digit, five digit, and so zero, zero, four, three, eight. Very important, one less. And second part, nine minus zero is nine. Nine minus zero is nine. Nine minus four is five. Nine minus three is six. And very important, last from ten. So final answer: four, three, eight. Nine, five, six, one. This zeros does not change the value. So whether you write this way or this way, it's the same thing. So case two, we can convert as case one just by putting zeros. Later on, we'll study third case where number of nines are less than number of digits. That will come in the second session. So that completes our all five topics of session one. Let's try to complete this homework on session one. Here are this number two, three, four, five refers to topic number. We have already taken questions on topic number one, that is history of Vedic mathematics. So topic number two and three, these are the questions. So out of that, when there is nine, the last digit is nine, we should use uh, topic tables of number ending with nine. Okay. So these two will have to solve with the tables of number ending with nine. And these four with tables of any two digit number. Second, it said complete following problems using the rule multiplication special case and then solve them. The first number is blank, second number you have to generate. Okay, we have taken one example. And then solve it. First, you have to complete this problem and then solve it. Fifth topic multiplication by series of. So solve all these problems. 